Dear friend, I have been where you are right now. Devastated, defeated, not knowing how to change your situation. Wondering if your life is even worth changing. I see you lock eyes with yourself in the mirror each morning. I know that your mind is filled with critical thoughts which begin to tell you from the second you are awake that this day today you will not achieve enough. That you will not accomplish anything that you set out to do. You stare at yourself in the mirror thinking how long it has been since you last felt you had achieved anything. You struggle to change your thought patterns to say something positive to yourself, to try and fix your spiraling thoughts into a cognitive pattern, to be mindful and aware that your thoughts have a direct effect on your day. So you smile, yet the bitterness builds and the rage wants to be let out. With every passing morning, with every pep talk gone wrong and with every day that you feel unsuccessful. Hope fades away. Do you remember when hope came easily? Back when you were a child? When your hopes were wrapped around things that are of no consequence to you anymore? Now, hope seems to do nothing but disappoint you. I know that people around you do not understand, but I do. To them, your hopelessness is confusing. They do not understand why you won't apply for your dream job, eat healthier or make new friends after discarding the ones who have mistreated you. But I do understand. I understand that when you have no hope, you feel nothing is worth the effort, that anything you try will be futile. I see you blaming yourself for not being able to manage your life. I see how it throws in, into a bottomless pit of despair. A despair that only serves to add new thoughts of destruction to your day. I know that. When you have no hope, your thoughts are so overpowering, so time consuming and energy draining that motivation leaves you completely. That you simply do not have the energy to make changes necessary to find a path out of the pit that you are in. Fear consumes you. A fear of rejection, of being lonely forever. You are scared, depressed and anxious. You feel that you are stuck in the same situation every day a loop until eventually you grow old in this misery. I know that you are afraid to even try because failure will mean that you have to deal with the pain of disappointment over again. You don't know if you can handle any more pain because I have been there, I know your despair, your hopelessness only sets you for further failure. Your thoughts will become a self-fulfilling prophecy. I know that if you have no hope, you will stop believing in yourself and this means that you will not find the courage to hope again, to change your internal mindset. I know that it is difficult to change, especially when you can no longer hope that things will change for you. I know that motivation takes energy and that you think you have none. I want you to help find a clear path. I will be the beacon of your light in this fog, so you will begin to climb out of this pit towards hope. Together we will create a plan, we will write down each step. These steps will be the foundation of the path you will lay on your journey. Today I want you to find a role model. Someone who has once overcome adversity and found courage to do so. I want you to read their story, immerse yourself in their life and look for situations that apply to you. I want you to speak positively to yourself. I will encourage you with supportive messages so that you once again can rebuild on hope. Please reach out to me when you are in despair and understand that it is only natural to lose your way from time to time. Perhaps tonight I can cook you dinner and tomorrow you can tell me how your day went while you plan your next step. 
Once your despair dissipates, you find your way back to your path again. You begin to help others. Understand that healing others often helps restore your self-worth and the sense that you have a purpose in life. When you have a purpose, you will begin to recover your belief in humanity. Allow me to help you become mindful. Mindful of your thoughts and how they shape your future. Let me help you change your dialogue within yourself. Today we will not talk about what you wish to achieve in the course of the day. Not yet anyway. First, I will help you to remember all the qualities that make you unique. I will help you squash the negativity that tears its head and fights you each morning. If you let me, I will teach you how to love yourself again. I want you to know that hopelessness is not permanent. That if you try, if you allow me to help you, if you regain focus and attention, hope will find you again. That you will be able to find strength to hope with all your heart and the ability to achieve anything that you set your mind to. Let's begin our learning process immediately so we can help one another to heal while negotiating life's difficult terrain. Today, we can begin to find hope in the beauty of nature and all its creations. We can work on believing in our goals and begin working towards realizing our dreams. Together we will awaken the inner strength that you have been dampening for so long. You will find your true self and learn how to look ahead once more. It may take a while but I am sure you will get there. My friend, I am with you and I love you.